decide to delete it, let's not go through all the trouble of, of naming everything right off. So here's the thing. Okay, now we need to, this is the one time that I duplicate bones is for the legs. And so I already had one, so I'm going to push that because I work right to left. So that would, that would have been the right one. So there we go. It's deleted already. And so what I'll do oftentimes is do like this. Just take it, move it directly across on the X, make sure that it lines up here, then duplicate and then move that one directly across and the X there. And so, you know, however you get this to work is fine. But there is something that you need to be very concerned about when dealing with bones and when we do the IK. So what you don't want to do at this point is take it and rotate it into place. It would seem like the smart and natural thing to do. Let me lock that. It would seem like a very good and easy, smart thing to do, but you don't want to do that. And the reason why is because we're going to add the IK on it ourselves. And you don't want to rotate bones before you don't want to rotate bones. I mean, it does. I have had problems. Let me say it like this. I have had problems where I have rotated bones, put the IK and then put them, you know, and then animate it and and every time I open a project and it might have been an early version of EI you know, and they might have it fixed now because I've tried to do it and it doesn't work but then I rotated the bones put the IK rotated the bone put the IK in close the project come back to the project and the bones are somewhere else and the legs are shooting other places and I couldn't figure out why every time I do that and it was that, it was literally what fixed it is that I put the IK in first, then move the bones to where they needed to be with the IK. So there might have been some kind of translation that picked up into the bones that uh, transferred over to the IK. And that is what I'm trying to get you to avoid. So we build up, we don't rotate the bones in it. So now that's just a precautionary procedure. I haven't been able to reproduce it again because uh, I was going to actually uh, test it, uh, put it in a beta report because someone else uh, had a problem. Uh, it was a well-known uh, electric image user. He had a problem with it. And and uh, so he had that problem and I tried to test it and I couldn't find it again. I couldn't make it happen again. I couldn't uh, duplicate the air. So... Uh, so he, uh, so I can't document it right now, but I have had that problem. So I'm, I'm just trying to give you some info on how to just completely avoid the problem. I know you won't have the problem if you work like this. And, and, and if you just don't rotate the bones, add the IK and then translate them into position. Uh, if you ever did the Fred Merlos uh, thing, he did that, uh, his rig, he did that as well. Uh, he did not rotate the bones. He put the IK in and moved it into position. I think that that's key. So let me show you about IK. Now that we've had all this discussion on what not to do and how it can make your life just... <laughs> how you can lose hair behind it. Let's go over a couple of things here. 